Have you always wanted to make your videos look like they just popped out of an old film? Well, now you can. Keep watching to find out how I got this look from a video I just took on my phone. Hi everyone, I'm Lauren Menarji, a content creator here on YouTube and Instagram where I share a lot of fashion, beauty, and lifestyle content. I'm so excited to be here on Kinemaster's channel to show you some editing tricks that I use when creating my videos. Kinemaster is my go-to source for editing and they make it so easy to produce your own videos. So to show you how I got this look, let's get started. First, I needed to make a video doing some sort of action, so I chose walking on the beach. So now let's open the Kinemaster app you'll see the new interface of the 5.0 version. Tap Create New and choose the aspect ratio of the project. I will be posting this video on TikTok and Instagram Reels, so let's choose 9.16. Then click Media, import all clips into the project and press OK. Select Clip and press the Filter button, then scroll down to Low Saturation and select L03. Make sure you repeat this step for each clip. This will create the closest look to an old film. Then select your first clip and make sure it's under five seconds. If it's too long, select the clip and drag it to the spot you want shortened. Once you have your intro clip ready to go, press the clips graphic button. Then select filmmaker and tap the first option of 01. This will give you a countdown of five seconds similar to what is seen in old films. For all other clips in the video, select the Clips Graphic button, then press the Filmmaker button and select 05 to create an old film look for the rest of the video. Add background music by tapping the audio button. This is a list of music downloaded from Kinemaster's Asset Store. Select the one you like and press Add button. To turn down the music from your original video, select the clip, select Mixer, and turn the volume to zero or your desired sound. Now that your video is complete, to save it to your gallery or photos app, tap the export button and adjust the settings by selecting your desired resolution and frame rate. want to work on this project on other devices that also have the KineMaster app, you can save the project into a Kina file with all the digital assets. How to do that? On the main screen, click the See All on My Projects. On this corner, you can rename and export the project to iCloud Drive. Now let's rename the project to Old Film, then save it to this KineMaster folder. You can create new folders to organize your files. You can also share this project using other apps such as email, text message, or other apps. So that's the end of the tutorial. I hope you all enjoyed the old film effect I created using KineMaster. And if you have any questions at all, go ahead and comment down below. Also, make sure to subscribe to KineMaster's YouTube channel so you can get more editing tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.